I'm going to share with you three best secrets for increasing soybean yield. Let me share with you what we're not talking about because I run across growers who believe that a high management soybean program is step one, plant them, step two, spray them, step three, harvest them, step four, complain about them. That's not a high management program. Let's talk about three things that we can do. Number one, let's row place some stuff that gets that bean up and going. What are we going to row place? Well, we're either going to put an inoculant, a really good rhizobium bacteria right on the seed, or we're going to row place that. And while we're row placing that, we should be row placing some sugar and probably some calcium. Now, if we would desire to put a little bit of a good ortho starter in there, that would be great. But step two, if we're going to push these yields, we all know that beans are temperamental. So to foliar or feed them at the correct stages, it's very important that if we're going to foliar or feed, know the right time of day, we know the right temperature, we know the right stage of the soybean. Now, obviously you can reach out. We'd be happy to go through those with you if you so desire. And number three, is the fact that soybeans need a lot of things. They don't just need a lot of phosphorus and a lot of potassium to get a good yield. There's a lot of other things that they need. And the micronutrients are super important. And we can foliar feed those the exact amount that we need based off of our tissue test.